the night of St. Patrick's Day, a near-fatal crash left a Knoxville man recovering from life-threatening injuries. He's still at UT Medical Center. Tonight, his sister wants justice as Knoxville police search for the suspect in a hit and run. Here's our Sam Luther. What justified you to just leave somebody in the middle of the road to die? Megan Harder has questions after her brother Jonathan was the victim of a hit and run Thursday night at the intersection of Magnolia and Bertrand. A KPD report says this red Toyota failed to yield and hit Jonathan's motorcycle. The driver then abandoned the vehicle just down the road and ran away while recovering at UT Medical Center. These images, a reminder. Kind of made him open his eyes to the fact that he really could have just died. A broken leg, shoulder, ankle, nose, and rib later, Jonathan is alive, but doctors told him he'll likely need a wheelchair for four months. His sister wants the hit and run driver found, but KPD says no one has been arrested. I pray every day that this person does the right thing, but in my mind, I know that it's, it's ultimately up to them. In Knoxville, Sam Luther, WVLT News. Now, Jonathan may get out of the hospital as early as Friday, but if you know who may have done this, you're asked to call KPD.